So my, my uh, co-creator is Steve Corning, uh, which he was on 207 uh, with Audio Body about a year ago, actually. Yes. Um, yeah, so Steve and I have been performing together for almost a decade, and we were looking for a new improv troupe. And uh, one of the names we came up with was Balderdash Academy, and we just put it aside because the next month we were cast in the Chamber of Comedy at Main Repertory Theater. Uh, so we, we had the property already sitting there. We put that aside when the pandemic hit. So we were looking for a way to get back online, looking for a way to, to do improv. We knew that improv, traditional improv through Zoom wouldn't work. So Steve and I pulled out the idea for Balderdash Academy and we started to rework it. Hello and welcome to Balderdash Academy. I'm your headmaster, Bob LeBlanc, and figure out how always, we could do what we do, still entertain people, still arts, maintain nice that sense again, of mental health, really trying to do something for the pandemic. And like you do, we stumbled onto the idea of an online comedy game show set at a fake school. So 16 more. 16 16? more. Yeah. Wow. All right. There's Somebody's a so. favorite. Molly, minus three. What? <laughs> <laughs> Our cast members, we call them faculty. And each member of the faculty has their own specialty. And what that specialty is, it just defines what topics their games will be about. Today's word of the day is anadipsia. Molly McGill anadipsia. is a copywriter professionally is with Warp and Weft uh, out of Lewiston. So she anadipsia. chose English language arts and she does yeah. games like word of the yes, day uh, and anadipsia. quote. Yeah, it's a dancing term. Uh, it's uh, specifically when your dancing partner is Anna and, uh, and you're looking for a little flourish to wow the judges. Our friend uh, Nate, Nate Green, during, uh, his uh, title's professor of STEAM. So science, technology, engineering, art, and math. And that's what his topics focus around. Marie runs Lisa Marie's Made in Maine out of Portland and Bath. So everything that, that she does is focused on home ec and wellness. Um, I'm the headmaster, so I'm, I'm the host. The uh, correct answer is he actually loses the fight to Apollo Creed. He doesn't win the fight, but he still got to the fight and that's the message. Wow, so, spoiler. Hal, okay, if I gotta say a spoiler to a 44 year old film, right? <laughs> it's a 90 minute uh, show we overall. Have, uh, we designed it so that it would work in video and when the pandemic ends, could be a product Marie that we could bring live. And then we hit our first main game, four questions. And those four questions are based around our visiting professor or our special guest for the show. Steve, mm -hmm. 600. And 62 points. That's Steven Spielberg reference. Poof. Glad I brought that up. Eight. <laughs> four. <laughs> we recently had on uh, Dr. Hal Cohen, who uh, is not I, only a physician, but he's also an actor and a playwright. Um, this is online right now. Anyone can watch it. You're obviously not making money off of this, but you're putting a lot of time and effort into this. That said, it's been a pretty difficult season for actors. I mean, you haven't mm -hmm. been able to go on stage. We're entertainers, first and foremost. It's what we do. And one of the, the big takeaways from being an entertainer is that you are essential. And, and in a time like this where we have emotional strife from, from the virus and the pandemic, where people are, are stuck in their homes. We have political strife happening. We are divided. She's sad. Oh, oh she's uh, upset. And she's playing a guitar. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of weight on a, on a person's spirit. And that's where we come in. We're the medicine. We're, we're, we're not the cure, but we're, we're a treatment. We are here to help people escape just a little bit during the day. Pointing down. Mm.